Hello, I'm Oksana Katsuro-Hopkins and I'll be teaching principle of applied mathematics, Columbia University E4001. This course is essentially a course in advanced linear algebra. And linear algebra uh, study vector spaces that sometimes can be referred as linear spaces. The first and primary goal of this course is to learn how to decouple system of equations. Um, the most important decoupling techniques we are going to cover in our course are Eigen decomposition and singular value decomposition, uh, so-called SVD theorem. Um, when we need to decouple a system of equations, we need to um, represent the problem on a special basis. Uh, hence, the concept of change of basis is highly important in our course. A secondary goal in our course is to present the concepts of um, linear algebra in a more general manner, to extend those concepts and techniques to abstract vector spaces, infinite vector spaces, or function spaces. For example, many techniques and terminology that are used with matrices and vectors can also be applied to polynomials, differential equations, different forms, tensor calculus, sturm liouville problems, and Hilbert spaces. This general viewpoint uh, find application in many disciplines in, in science, and thus um, the class will not just give you techniques uh, that you can use in your work, but it will also prepare you for more advanced classes. This course is usually taken by first-year graduate students, um, however, some advanced undergraduates take it also. Knowledge of linear algebra is typically provided by an introductory course such as Columbia E3001 or V2010 is recommended. Uh, we're going to review the concept of linear algebra that's relevant to the course in the first lecture. Um, however, if you never took the linear algebra before, um, it, may, you, it will require lots of reading for you on your part. Um, uh, some people did it successfully in the past, um, so don't get discouraged. Uh, ordinary differential equations, partial differential equations, and complex analysis are not required. Um, however, a basic knowledge of the subject is, um, is recommended. Uh, so you, if you forgot it, just look, look in the books, but um, we'll review some of it in the class also. Okay, um, let's now look at the course outline. I'm not going to go into details. I'll just mention what we're going to study. Um, so the first lecture, as I mentioned before, is going to be linear algebra review, vector spaces, basis and dimensions. After that, uh, second lecture, we're going to look at linear transformation, change of basis, and we'll introduce eigenvalues. Um, lecture number three will look more at eigenvalues and also at eigenvectors. Um, we'll look also at diagonalization of operators. Uh, that's actually how we decouple simple system of equations. Um, lecture number four will look at applications of those techniques. We'll look at the different equations, differential equations, and linear stability. After that, um, we'll move on to inner product spaces and project operators, Gram-Schmidt orthogonalization. You might have heard or might study some of those techniques before, so uh, for some of, some of you it's going to be a brand, brand new subject. Uh, lecture number six, extremely important subject, least square solutions and pseudo inverses. Um, that's extremely useful, use, used in so many different fields and in my work particular too. Singular value decomposition, gorhin lewiv decomposition is going to be after that. And uh, this is also an extremely important subject. After that, lecture number eight and nine, we're going to look at the adjoints and Hermitian operators and unitary operators and Fred Friedholm alternative theorem. Lecture number 10 and 11, we're going to look at partial differential equations. In particular, we will study the wave equation and we'll introduce Fourier series. Eigenfunction expansions also is going to be introduced in this, in this lecture. Lecture number 12, maybe the last lecture of the course, we'll introduce spectral theory and distribution theory and Dirac delta function. 
Um, if we run out of time, that's, as I mentioned, that's going to be last lecture. However, if um, we have more time and if students are interested, we're going to look at two more subjects, Fourier integral transform and application to PDEs, diffusion heat equations, and we'll introduce the green functions. If we don't have time, I can just give some students a copy of my lectures and ask, answer questions afterwards. Uh, the textbooks for the course is Applied Linear Algebra, The Decoupling Principles by Lorenzo Sadun. Um, this has book been just reprinted as a second edition. I think the book is written very easy. It's very nice to read. And uh, our course is going to follow this textbook pretty close enough. Uh, you can buy it in Columbia Bookstore or on Amazon.com. Um, the course is going to be, uh, we're going to have a weekly homework assignments. It's going to be graded, midterm and final. Um, they are equally important to receive a good grade for the course. How the grade is going to be calculated is written in syllabus. You can download it from the website. It's already there. This course covers a wide range of topics. Useful in physics, biology, engineering, control theory, just to name a few. I have a PhD in plasma physics, and in my work, um, at least half percent of those, like 50 percent of those techniques I use daily, directly or indirectly. And, and so I think this class will be very useful for you also, regardless of your field, and in the future you will apply these techniques the way as I do now. Um, I welcome any questions about, this, about the course. Please contact me by email. Um, I hope you enjoy the class and you like the materials the way as I do. Thank you, and um, I hope to see you signing up for the class. <laughs>